Currently, our explosive only affects the object that it collides with. We want to change this to affect all of the objects within a range. In your project window, locate Assets, Resources, Scripts, find your explosive script, and double click to open it. Scroll down to your On Destroy method. Just below where we instantiate our boom, add a couple more blank lines of workspace. Declare a collider array by typing collider with opening and closing brackets and name it colliders hit. Set it equal to physics dot overlap sphere with open and close parentheses. Pass in our explosion's position at transform dot position comma and the radius we're checking will be size. Put a semicolon at the end of your line, then go to the next line, type for each, open parentheses and close parentheses, collider, named collider, in colliders hit. And below your for each, place your opening and closing curly bracket. Physics.overlap sphere will find all the colliders within a range of our object, and then for each of them, we're going to execute our code. The code we're going to need is just above in our onTriggerEnter method. First, select where we get the rigid body and add our explosion force. Cut it to remove it from the onTriggerEnter method and paste it in our new for each loop in our onDestroy. Because other no longer exists here, and we're checking our new colliders, each named collider, we're going to replace this with collider. Next, we're going to do the same thing with our take damage. Select where we get our health component and call our take damage method. Cut it out of the on trigger enter method and paste it just below our other if statement inside our for each loop. Again, we're going to change this reference to other to collider. Save your file. Now in our onTrigger enter, we're only checking to see if we're not colliding with a player. Then we'll destroy the game object if we are colliding with something other than a player. Then when it's destroyed, we're going to get each of the colliders within our range. And then for each of those colliders that we find, if it has a rigid body, add the explosion force, then check if it has a health script, and then tell it to take damage.